this video I'm going to be explaining to you kind of my favorite defense right now in the game. One of the best coverages overall that you can utilize against any formation. And it's just a simple defense, but I want to kind of kind of explain why it's effective and kind of the purpose behind uh, the coverage. Now, this is in the nickel 3-3 cub defense. If you guys want to check out my full nickel 3-3 cub defensive ebook, I'm going to put a link to our school community down in the description below. The school site is really cool because it's only 10 bucks. It gets you access to everything that we do for both Madden and for College Football 25. Over 20, over 15, I think over 15 ebooks total. I know we're very close to like eight or nine ebooks for Madden, and I've got more on the way. And then we are going to be actually doing some revamps and some new stuff for college guys as well. So if you guys want to get access to all of that content, that's going to be in the description. Again, school.com slash Cody Ballard. The link is going to be in, down below. Ten bucks will get you access to all of the content on that site. Uh, what I wanted to talk about today is a, is really one of my favorite coverages every single year. And specifically, we're going to use it out of 3-3 Cub. And so what we're going to do is we're going to turn on a specific package. So if you look here at the screen, I'm going to flick my right joystick at the play call screen, and it's going to flick over to the safety nickelback package. That's going to put a safety at the nickelback position. Now, feel free to sub players out and back in, and obviously there's still some visual bugs uh, with where players are, but in general safety nickelback package and you can sub your players out and then back in to kind of prevent any randomness and then for coaching adjustments here we're going to have auto flip defensive play call on option defense is going to be on conservative and that's pretty much all we're going to do and then what we're going to do here is we're going to be coming out in you can really come out in any play that you want i personally prefer the blitz angles and the alignment out of mike blitz zero but if you want to save yourself a couple of adjustments, then you could come out in cover two or Tampa two. But what you'll see here is we have a very, very good little defense for you. And this is this is a, uh, a technique that you can use called roll coverage. It's essentially what we're going to do is we're going to make cover three cl cloud adjustments uh, within this. And the reason this is effective is because typically – when in Madden you're playing these trips bunch type formations where there's three receivers to one side they really want to high low that sideline so what we're going to do is if we ever want to send pressure out of this um, we're actually going to roll the coverage like like this here and then we're just going to send our pressure now the reason the main reason why we're doing these adjustments is because we can put these soft squats on the outside and the soft squad is my opinion is the best zone in the game um, and what I like to do here is I actually like to press and then I like to back off both of my outside corners and this is going to kind of keep everything in front of you it's going to be hard for them to just flat out kill you one way or the other if you want to you can also put this left side safety on a deep half that will kind of prevent some one play touchdown type stuff. And if they send five out, literally this right here is almost always going to get instant pressure. Now, I don't send five a lot. I just send five whenever I start to notice that they're consistently sending five receivers out on routes. From there, what I like to do is we're going to utilize these soft squats. And then the other thing we're going to do here consistently is we're going to have this vert hook on this right side and what I like to do is shade underneath so that I might want to re soft squat after I do that and then you would have your coverage kind of look like this and effectively this is a good coverage to switch stick onto and one of the best route combinations that you see constantly is this corner uh, streak post with like a backside drag or something right this soft squat and outside third combination is just going to absolutely take this away. It's never going to be able to be thrown. Of course, I throw it, but I'm right there. Two players, that would be an interception any other time, right? So if you wanted to do this out of Tampa 2, um, a couple issues here. So first and foremost, the blitz angles are a little bit different. And then if you come out in this, this would actually be aligned properly. So the blitz angles are a little bit different. And also, they're not actually on vertical hooks this year for some reason. So... So kind of some things to kind of keep in mind here. But if you do shade underneath, you can then re-soft squat, um, re-soft squat these guys. And then from there, if you want to stay in this cover two like this, or you can actually vert hook the guy yourself and kind of get into the coverage, get into the coverage this way. Whoops. Why that's 
and it's kind of being weird here for us. But anyways, I prefer to just make the adjustments out of mic blit zero. Now, the beauty of this is this, this basically applies to any formation that you want to guard. So let's say they audible over to Bunch Strong Nasty. One of my favorite things to do here is to actually utilize, situationally, you can also utilize some man-ups. So we might run a coverage like, like this, for example, here. And we're still utilizing the soft squad on that right side. And then if you want to send four, you can send four. Or, um, you know, you can have, you know, you could have two guys manned up here on the right side. You could have this guy on a vert hook and run the defense like this. Um, I just think it's a very versatile uh, way to play defense. And it just constantly, I think, keeps everything in front of you. It makes it hard for them just to sit back and throw corner routes. Like even if they have a, an underneath route, you see, look at that man up and that outside third, just take away the corner route. Again, the main purpose of the defense is to take away the deep corners of the field. And then occasionally, the other thing you can also do, uh, just kind of situationally, is you can play hard flats on the south side, and then you could send, you know, basically a defense like this, where we're going to send, we're going to send our our five. We have a man up here. And essentially, we're just trying to get aggressive and get a stop, right? So situationally, you can kind of tune those flats down or keep them at the soft squad or even cloud flat them. Um, one of my favorite adjustments to do in this game is to utilize these soft squats and then utilize that kind of cover three concept from these thirds. And then from there, what I would do, like in a long yard situation, probably send four, and then we're just going to protect the sticks. And again, I really like to, to back these guys off. And you'll see here that by protecting the sticks, it'll just keep them at that depth of whatever it might be, 10 yards, 15 yards, 20 yards. So it's a really nice, safe coverage uh, for you to use. Now, just to kind of illustrate how fast you can set this up, the more you work on this, is it's really not, um, you see here, like we're basically already set up and we're in our defense. And I like this, and then like I said, situationally we can do things like cross man, we can cross man players, we can you know kind of do however we want. But I think this is a very simple and simultaneously very effective defense, way to play defense. And sometimes that four man will come in off that edge. If you guys want to check out my full 3-3 Cub defensive ebook, I'll put a link to it in the description below to go sign up for the school site. Remember, by being a member of the school site, you're going to get access to all of my offensive and defensive ebooks, both for Madden and for College Football 25.